how to query Business Central data in Excel. In this video, I'd like to show you how to create Business Central data in Excel. Business Central offers the users the ability to create page data in Excel using web services. This allows users to have real-time Business Central data available in Excel sheets that can be queried charts and dashboards built and saved for future uses. There are two main types of objects that provide data. They are page and queries. These provide information that you'll see on screen. First, we're going to navigate to the search and we'll type in customers. And we're going to choose from the customer list. And this is going to show us our list of customers in our demo company. So let's open this one. I'm now going to press Control Alt F1. And this is going to bring up the page inspection. It's going to show that this page is number 21. And it's called the customer card and it's pulling data from the table number 18. Which is the customer. And these are all the fields that are available on the page. Once we have that. Just close that. We're going to go up to search. And we're going to type in web services. And we're going to select it. Now this shows us the uh, different types of objects here. So we're going to click on. Oh, let me just scroll up. And we're going to click on. This one because this is where the. Customer card tells us to go. And let me just expand this. And we're going to go to the. O data. V4 URL. And we're actually going to copy this link address. This is the different pages and different queries that's related to the customer. So next what we're going to do is we are going to navigate into Excel. We're going to go into the data tab. Get data. From other sources. And from O data feed. This will bring up the O data feed window right here. Let's just give it a second to load. And we're going to paste the URL that we copied earlier. And we're going to use the basic option and then press OK. In this window here. It shows us a sample of our data and the columns. We can transform the data, but in this example, we'll just load it into our spreadsheet. So. Click on load. Right now it's querying the data from your business central. And this right here is live data from Dynamics 365. We can create pivot tables, charts, graphs, and dashboards with this data in different tabs. This concludes how to query Business Central data in Excel.